Hey, how are you guys doing? And welcome back to another episode of Path to Power. Now, by the title, you guys can already tell that I hit Elite One again with the new, the new team. I hit Elite One, absolutely buzzing, guys, because like starting a whole entire weekend with a new team and not playing a single game throughout the whole entire weekday is absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing, and to fight, and to hit Elite One. It feels like I'm an elite one player. It really does feel like I'm an elite one player, but I'm really not. Um, some people might class me as an elite one player just because I've hit elite one twice. Uh, I've hit elite one three times. It doesn't mean I'm an elite one player. If I can hit elite one consistently for a month, then I will consider myself an elite one player. But not all. But not all elite one players obviously hit. Um, not all elite one players obviously hit elite one every single week. But um, I think I think I'm getting there. I'm getting there, and maybe one day. I can hit a top 100, get 37 wins, get 36 wins, um, maybe. As you guys saw, we do have 25, 25 wins with 10 games left. Uh, that that's what happened last time we did hit Elite One. We only had uh, yeah, we had, we had 25 wins with 10 games left. 25 and five once again. Um, I like I, I, I like whenever I'm playing, I don't like to repeat a cycle. But if I repeat a cycle and I get the exact same exact same um a finish then i really don't mind i really don't mind but yeah we hit elite one again absolutely buzzing get two 100k packs and two team of the week packs once again and uh, the first game the first game was a struggle guys i was struggling like i was so nervous because at first i was like okay i had to get these five wins just these five wins to get um to get elite one monthly and once I got the Elite One Monthly, I really did not care. Now, you guys might not believe me, but when I say, oh, I didn't care, I didn't want Elite One, I am being 100% honest with you guys. As soon as I hit uh, um, uh, uh, the 30 wins, I really did not care because all I wanted was Elite One Monthly. I did not care if I got Elite One. If I got Elite One weekly, then, then congratulations to me. But if I didn't, I really would mind it. And right there, that goal was disgraceful from Ferdinand. That was the only mess up Ferdinand made this whole entire weekend. That's the only time I can blame Ferdinand for a mess up. L literally the only time I can blame him. But um, other than that, Ferdinand was an absolute beast. This team was an absolute beast. Blanc was an absolute tank. The Neymar was an absolute tank. Flipping Hernandez was beautiful. But I think I might have to get rid of Hernandez. I might have to get someone else. Maybe um, an Mbappe or something. I'm not sure. Maybe I might do another base icon. See if I can pack R9 or something. But... Um, <clears throat> Yeah, I do. Have, I do really need to get rid of him. And I just to let you guys know, if I sound tired, um, it is because I'm recording this five o'clock, six o'clock in the morning while everyone's asleep. If I'm sounding a bit quiet as well, uh, it's because people are sleeping, and I'm just going to record this now because I know that when I wake up uh, in the afternoon, I'm really not going to want to record this, and uh, I just want to get this video out to you guys because I know you guys are liking the Path to Power series and like and liking how I'm progressing um, through through uh, through Fit Chance because I just get on Twitter called tyler um he, he he messages me and and uh and uh he he like not everyone not everyone understands the concept of fifa so i'm just um i'm just gradually helping him helping him understand the concept of fifa um <clears throat> concept of fifa how to abuse how to abuse um no sorry what to abuse and what not to um what not to do uh in fifa i'm just helping him gradually uh throughout throughout the game and uh i i actually, I actually really like doing it. i really like doing it because i get to communicate with myself, I get to communicate with you guys, and uh, I feel like I feel like I actually I actually like, get a connection, a connection between you guys, and I know how you guys feel about FIFA, and you guys know how I feel about FIFA. So uh, you guys can DM me if you want. My DMs are open. Also, I'm going to say this once again: if you guys want to be featured in a top five, <coughs> sorry, but like, if you guys want to be featured in a top five um, Fortnite or like you know Fortnite funny, sending your Fortnite clips, you guys will be um, in a top five packs. Send in your top five packs or top five goals. Send them to me to my Twitter. My DMs are always open. Now, um, <clears throat> um, I'm not sure if there's going to be a top five pack opening out um, this Wednesday or you no know, this Thursday. I don't, I'm not sure if there's going to be one out. I might just give you rewards on Thursday and then gameplay on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And um, potentially Saturday, Sunday. I might take Saturday and Sunday off because I'm doing something on Saturday, Sunday. Up. Saturday, Sunday, spend time with my mum on Saturday, Sunday. Uh, so I, I, I might take that day off. I'm not sure. I haven't actually made up my mind just yet. My schedule is a bit all over the a bit all over the place. Uh, my sleeping schedule is poor. I haven't even slept yet, and it's six o'clock in the morning. Absolutely terrible. But um, let's just comment on the gameplay right now, guys. Uh, you guys saw that I was two 0 down in this game, and we brought it back to three two. I'm just gonna say this now, guys. I did not deserve to win this game. 
100% did not deserve to win this game, but I do not know how. GG to SGT Crow. I did not deserve to win that game. Even though I had more possession, he absolutely dominated me. I don't know how I won the game. But we got our 29th win. All needed was one more win for the Elite One. And then we come up against a God Squad. Not even a single gold card in there. All I'm seeing is blue. Literally blue. That's all I'm seeing is blue. And, uh, you know you, you know what happens, guys. Whenever I come up against like a team like this, they always score a rebound goal. Making it 1-0 with Cristiano Ronaldo. Then Ronaldo's running. Fake shot. Can't do anything. Finesse. It's going to fly into the back of the net. Making it 2-0 in the 30th minute. Can you really do anything about that? I really want. Can anyone do anything about that? Then Messi is played through here. Wasn't really bothered. Like, I knew I wasn't going to win this game. So, like, when you know you're, gonna, when you know you're not going to win a game, you don't really try anymore. I really didn't try anymore, but we did manage to get a goal here. Salah and Bergkamp and Neymar linking up really well. Managed to get a goal. 3-1 in the 54th minute. But this guy did smack me like 6-1. I think I'll show you one more goal and that's it. Um, I think he smacked me like 6-1, I do believe. Because after, after the goal went in, I started messing about. I really couldn't be bothered. <coughs> I really couldn't be bothered to actually play after he scored that goal. So, uh, yeah, he smacked me 6-1. Robert, GG. Definitely deserve to win that game. 29 wins. Now we have to win the rest of our games to get Elite 1. So 29 games, 5 games left. I have to clutch this up to get Elite 1. I know I already spoke it for you guys, but you guys can see how I hit Elite 1. Now we do get a bit lucky here with Blanc. Making it 1-0 in the 5th minute. And this guy is going to rage quit. When he rage quit, 100% honest, when he rage quit, I was so damn happy because that's 30 wins and that is elite one i knew i could get elite one monthly only was 30 wins i knew i could do it now at this point i'm like okay if i lose from this point i'm going to stop playing because there's really no point of me um there's really no point of me getting uh elite two because it's basically the exact same rewards it's that same rewards and uh if if i lost i really would not have mind stopping because the only reason why I continued playing was because I could potentially get Elite 1. That was the only reason why I, I continued playing. But in this game, we do go 1-0 in the 20th minute. And this guy does rage quit as well. So that's 31 wins. I don't know why he rage quit. I don't know why he rage quit, but I can't speak. I don't know why he rage quit. I was like, there's like 3 hours left in the weekend. I really don't know why he rage quit. But um, then we come against a 4-4-2 side. As I said last episode, I love to test my 4-4-2. And my opponent's 442. See whose 442 formation is better. And then we do get off to a really good start. Yeah, I told him playing Burkamp through. Beautiful, beautiful ball. I told him to do a low driven, but he had it, but he decided to roof it. Don't care as long as he scored. Then Burkamp once again uh, turn, turning the defender and he does make it 2 0 in the 45th minute. And then he does get an, and then he, he gets a goal in the 45th minute. I read the pass. I read everything, guys. You guys can see in this episode, I've read most of my opponent's passes. And my players just don't stick out a leg to get it. And then he scores a really good goal. I did not expect that. Like, when he scored that, I was a bit angry because he scored the first goal in the 45th minute. But when he scored that, I could really not complain because that was a beautiful goal. But then Neymar, <laughs> talk about five-star weak foot. Talk about five-star weak foot. He just does that. Neymar is an absolute tank, guys, I'm telling you. Then we do get a bit lucky here. I actually didn't tell Blanc to pass that. I think he's defender passed it to my Bergkamp and Bergkamp does score. Just make it 4-2. And we, ha and we have got 32 wins. 32 wins. And as I said before, guys, if I lost a game, I really wouldn't mind. But the only thing I did mind was losing the game to this guy. That's the only thing I minded. Losing the game to this guy. Because this was the most irritating game I played all flipping weekend. The most irritating. I do a drag back and a low driven uh, shot with a bird cap. Making it 1-0 making it in the 14th minute. Now when I tell you guys I had so many opportunities. So many opportunities in the first half leading up to this goal. I am telling you, all I was doing was hitting the post, hitting it wide. I don't know how my players were hitting it wide from the penalty spot. And he makes it 2-1 in extra time, 94th minute. And I had to clutch up with Salah in the 120th minute to score a really, really scrappy goal. Making it 2-2 in the 120th minute. Salah, absolute saviour. Then we went to penalties. I scored three of my goal. I, I scored three of mine. And he, uh, he scored three of his. And he, 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 he had already missed one. So my Hernandez steps up and we do go straight down the middle, finessing it, 
straight down the middle. And if I save this penalty, uh, I do uh, I do get my 33rd win. And uh, we do guess where he's going. David De Gea, the saviour, the best keeper in the world at the moment. David De Gea does get us our 33rd win. Because you never know, David De Gea could have dived over that ball. I could have missed my next penalty. He could have scored his next penalty. I could have missed my next penalty. And he could have scored and he could have won the game. So David De Gea did come out clutch there. And we do get a 33rd win. And now uh, we're going to go on to the next game. The next game is against the most easiest opponent, guys. The easiest opponent I have played all weekend. And when I say the easiest, I mean some guy that does not know how to play the game but he has this team. In former Guerrero, wants to watch Salah, Icon Mateus, with Team of the Year, Benucci, in form Pogba, Icon Maldini, I'm telling you that this guy was rubbish. But it took me 28 minutes to score because I was hitting the post, hitting it wide, hitting the keeper. It was the most, those last two games were the most irritating. Look, I, I'm showing an example. Blanc, how are you missing from there? That is what I don't understand. That is all I was doing all game, guys. All game, that's what I was doing. But we do get a chance here with Hernandez, and we do make it 2-0 just before halftime. And at this moment, I knew that I had secured Elite 1 because this guy was terrible. And a bird camp here, making it 3-0 in the 48th minute. And, guys, we have secured Elite 1 once again. And uh, this guy does, he, he, he actually stopped playing, and the timer ran out, and, uh, you know, uh, he did. Uh, he did end up ghosting. As you see, twelve shots, eight on target. Twelve shots, eight on target, yeah, guys. That game should have been over in the first half, but it took me to the second half for, to actually dead the game off. It's absolutely embarrassing. But uh, thirty-four wins, six losses. Unfortunately, we couldn't get like, thirty-seven or thirty-six, whatever. But we do manage to get elite one monthly and elite one weekly. The rewards video will be out on Thursday or Friday. I'm not sure just yet. I haven't made up my mind just yet. But I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. I hope you guys do decide to come back and uh, hit that sub button. Hit, hit the notification button and the like button and the share button. Share it with your friends. But I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. Don't forget to hit like button and subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Yeah.